Rock on this Blue Friday. It is, of course, our friend and Colts official DJ, DJ No. He's here with us this morning, bringing us the upbeat Friday vibes as we get ready for the big matchup between, between the Colts and Steelers. We'll have more on that, but first, I'll send it over to Sierra with more Colts. Oh, yeah, we've got good vibes here heading into game day this morning. The Colts taking a trip back in time as they host the Pittsburgh Steelers on Sunday afternoon at Lucas Oil Stadium. Back to the 1950s. Uh, thanks to these iconic uniforms, that game actually is not on Sunday. It is on Saturday. But uh, we are throwing it back, and it's really cool stuff that you've got here. Yeah. It's so fun. We're here this morning uh, to talk about that throwback game with Hayden Barnack, of course. The one and only, which Blue told us he forgot to do his laundry this week, so you don't have your throwback jersey. <laughs> Take it off. Get out of here. <laughs> no, but we, you've got some really cool stuff, uh, both for the players, the cheerleaders, and the fans. So let's start with these special player jerseys. Kind of talk about what those are going to be like. Yeah, we are so excited to throw it back to the 1950s era. So we are inspired by the 1956 team. Um, it features this helmet here that has the iconic horseshoe on the back, as well as three stripes on the sleeve of the jersey. So a little bit different than um, what you see on the yes. field now. So we're really excited to be wearing that. and leaning into the 50s. Yes, it's subtle, but it is different. That's really cool. That's a Taylor jersey that you've got there. Mm -hmm. um, and then there's also, of course, we have to include the cheerleaders in this because they, of course, had different uniforms in the 50s. Absolutely. The Colts cheerleaders were actually the first NFL team dating back to 1954. They will be wearing these white sweaters on field throughout the game. So really pulling in the past and having some special nods for the fans to see tomorrow. I think we should make blue put that <laughs> <laughs> He's giving us a show this morning. All right. So the cheerleaders have the sweaters, but also fans, you're, you have this special bucking horse logo, which I think is just so cool. It's, it's retro, but modern at the yes. same time. I so love this design. This is a brand new piece that we actually partnered with a local Indianapolis brand home field on to create. Yes. So they took our bucking horse logo and made it realistic. So we're really excited to debut that today at 10 a.m. at the Colts Pro Shop. And you guys did a couple other things with home field this year too, right? We you designed did. a whole line at the beginning of the season. It's really cool stuff. If you haven't checked it out, you should. Um, and then Colts fans, of course, you can buy the gear, but they get a special pennant as well when they come to the game. Yes, the pennant is for the first 30,000 fans. <laughs> um, through the gates tomorrow afternoon. So if you're looking for something extra special to, to grab, we recommend coming early to pick it up. It has the bucking horse on it as well. One for everybody. <laughs> That's awesome. So you said the first 30,000 fans to come in. Correct. That's a great gift. You could even gift it as a Christmas gift. You absolutely could. Who just in love time that? for Christmas. Yeah. But yeah, all of the Colts gear you see, the jerseys, the cheer sweater, the t-shirt, they're all at the Colts Pro Shop. And there's even more throwback stuff in there as well. That's amazing. What a cool thing. Dude, the Colts history is just amazing. The gear makes it an even better nod. <laughs> Blue, thank you so much. I'm I'm really upset that we didn't get a full fashion show in a jersey, but that's all right. Next time. You'll do your laundry before this weekend? Deal. All right. Sounds good. Hey, for a closer look back at that 1956, uh, the whole line here, you can head to fox59.com slash links. We've got it all for you. Jim, are you ready for the game? I'm ready for the game.